chill. Hello, my dudes. I'm so tired. <laughs> I need to do a self tape right now. I'm so tired, I can't even like hold my arm up. I drank a little bit last night, like not even a lot, but since I haven't really been drinking much lately because it just was making me feel shitty. Um, I don't know, I don't know. It's like, I'm, I'm so exhausted. Um, I'm very like gender reveal right now with my outfit. I just need the top to be like, a nice standout color so I'm gonna practice my lines and since I don't have a reader here right now I'm gonna record myself doing the other lines so that I can talk to myself essentially oh my god I like I haven't done a voice recording on my phone since December of 2020 and all of these November December they are all oh my god my voice recording section is not a fun place it's all like a very traumatic place it's all like of my crazy neighbor oh my god I never put that video out huh where is that footage? It's on my external hard drive somewhere, it has to be. I just saw it on my Snapchat like a month ago and it was from one year ago today, me saying that I just went to court and she didn't show up and everything. So that was so long ago. And that was after I had already moved into this house. <sighs> So it was back in November, December of 2020, but these are all recordings of her like screaming at me. And then before that, it's February, which was the crazy shit with my ex. So none of this is good. I feel like on my other phone, it's like a bunch of just me like talking and like some creative ideas that I get. It's not like that on this phone. It's very um, disturbing. Anyway, I'm gonna record myself now. This is gonna be my first time practicing. Like I read through the lines last night, but I haven't practiced them. <laughs> Now I need to learn my lines, which I do by... I don't just like read them and memorize them usually, but I don't really like to do that anymore because it kind of has a scab on my arm. I feel like I, if I memorize it first, then I like already know what's coming and I don't really know the natural way that I would be saying it when acting and I don't... Like I need to try out a few different inflections and like demeanors and because you know they don't give you that sometimes they do like they'll say like they look defeated or whatever but they want to see you know how you would play a character so i feel like when i memorize it before it's just not the best and that's why i only like have looked at them once because i have a crazy memory like i've always memorized things so quickly and they stay with me like forever so it's just not ideal for this situation i would put you guys in front of me but there's nowhere to put you so I know I'm gonna have to be like editing this out, or not editing it out, but like muting it. So hopefully you enjoy watching my very subtle facial expression. So this is a very like moody, well, the first part's just like me talking to my friend. Second part's like me with a dude, but it's, it's very, it's very subtle. So anyway, and I'm still reading my lines because I don't know them. Chewing bubs. I am insane, but like feeling accomplished, but also still overwhelmed. I've just, I, I've been slowly, slowly chipping away at like going through my clothes, either donating them or they're under my bed ready for me to sell for Poshmark. And now after going through them again, I have four huge more bins for Poshmark and it's like, uh, I already donated so much stuff. It took me and my sister like four trips back and forth. Then today I found more that I'm gonna donate that I was going to sell, but I was like, no, donate. Cause I, I just wanna get rid of stuff. And I've realized like, so I got, okay, backtrack. For example, 
I got ready today and I was like, okay, I need to film this and I need to film this and whatever, whatever. And I actually needed to get some photos taken. I'm going to film my self tape tomorrow because that's when my backdrop stand is going to arrive. Because the one that I had, I don't know, I'm an idiot and I leave stuff outside and like it's rained in the past year and a half so you know anyway um so i got ready and it's literally 6 45 right now and when i tell you that i have been cleaning and organizing and throwing shit away and like going through every square inch of my house i am not kidding but i still feel super overwhelmed <laughs> but it's definitely coming along Al along along yeah what was i gonna say i just realized like i need to do this because it's literally like having things everywhere and having even if it's like all in my closet and i can't necessarily see it like having that there is making me like unable to feel fully at ease and creative and like inspired and whatever whatever it takes in order to be a creative person you know like i haven't filmed an only fans video at home in a really really long time really long time um and so I went out to my car and I was like putting stuff away and then I just like fully cleaned out my car. I just want to get things looking how I have been wanting them to look <laughs> for a long time. But I mean, it, it was like a 10 hour day of me doing that today and it's like, it's still not done. But I ordered a couple of things that are going to help out. I ordered like a hutch for above my desk so that I can have like nothing on my desk because having my desk and my vanity be the same is a joke. I haven't decided yet which is which. This will probably be my desk, but the mirror is not gonna stay here. I got a desk that attaches to the wall, so it's like a floating desk, and I'm literally gonna put it, I mean, I'll show you when I do it, but right now there's a mirror there, but it's like on my third landing of stairs under the window. I'm gonna put it there. That's gonna be like my, I think that's gonna be my vanity, and I'll just put the makeup in it, because it folds, and it, then it folds up, and it looks like a cabinet. So like when you're not using it, it doesn't look cluttery. I'm just like, the clutter is like fucking with me, you know? I have so many goddamn walls in this place and I'm always like, I don't have any storage space. But like there's so much space in here, but there's not like any built-ins. Like I'm gonna utilize my wall space. Like I have the tallest fucking ceilings and I have three stories. So there's like no reason why I shouldn't be like doing that. And then like it just minimizes the stuff like on the ground. And like I tell this to like my sister and my boyfriend and my friends and they're like, what are you talking about? Like your house is like, it's like spotless. It almost looks like a staged house except for like all your items. And I'm like, it's not. That's my little update, I guess. I was gonna say something else, but then I went off on a tangent about why it's 7 p.m. and I'm just about to leave and maybe go to, probably not go to the gym. I don't know. I don't know. And also just like with the situation I've been in, like if you saw my last video, having all this clutter is like, and not being able to be creative and th like think and be strong and determined, like it, this needed to happen I think before I can get into my groove. So that's what's happening. Bitch, how is this already gonna die? I swear. I poop. First of all, why are you screaming at me? Like I'm gonna give you a TREA too when I just gave you some. <gasps> Hi, I look like Zach Morris, but like his sister. This top came with like a matching skirt from Dolls Kill when I used to work with them, which I haven't in a long time. Ugh. My house has been undergoing changes. Yeah, I think I did talk about this. One of the things that's gonna help with that came, which is my wall mounted desk. I can show you where I think I'm gonna put it. So we're on my second floor right now, right? Okay. Bug, shaggy. So basically, I still need to pop that plant. I'm aware. Bug, shut up. <laughs> so I envisioned it. Oh wait, now I'm literally now I am realizing how weird this would be because of the railing. <laughs> I don't know if I would put it. I guess I would put it. Nope, it would need to go above the railing in order to not look weird. But then I would need like a really tall chip. See, this is why. Thing is, I even I did like measure this. And I made sure that it was going to be not super long. And then I made sure it wasn't going to stick out too much. And I made sure it wasn't going to be too tall. So it like would go up to the window. You see what I mean by I have just like so much fucking wall space everywhere. Working on that thing. Wait, was I going to use this as a vanity or as a desk? I can't remember. Maybe I should just build it. What if I just put it there? And it was just like 
I couldn't even use it because it was just impossibly high. Here's my current vanity slash desk situation. But like it would make sense for upstairs to be my office more so than, especially because I have the cabinet, I have my printer. Styrofoam, <laughs> my worst fucking enemy. Um, there's so much, I like I don't understand the necessity. There is so much styrofoam in here. Like. Mm. That sound makes my vagina shrivel up. I have chills. If anyone else, <laughs> if anyone else gets the styrofoam chills, comment below. I hate when I do that. I thought I was just gonna like put the trash downstairs and come back up, and I forgot I was still recording. So then there's just 10 minutes of nothing on my camera. I changed into a shirt. I just feel like I should get my vacuum because this is messy. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of these are so fucked up. Like, I certainly hope this isn't a part that's like showing a lot. Hi my dudes, I just wanted to pop in here and end the vlog properly because I never fucking do that. I figured I would be really fucking professional. Speaking of professional, look at this bitch. Oh, she's fancy. Uh, my boyfriend left for a week today, or he left yesterday, and I'm really sad. Okay, bye.